Good day everyone, in this video we are going to review different kinds of 31mm Veston bulb or LED and I hope that everyone are familiar with this kind of bulb because this is the kind of bulb that are mostly used for dome light also called cab cabin light, interior light, reading light or whatever they name it is. So there are hundreds of different kinds of Veston bulb and I am able to collect 7 kinds of LED as you can see on the video. So stay tuned as we test its power or watts, radiated temperature and brightness in terms of lux on these different LEDs. So for baseline, we have two different kinds of 31mm Feston halogen bulb, 5 watts and 8 watts. These are the OEM bulbs installed when the vehicle is freshly out from the dealership. So this is 2835 LED chip, its chip length is 3.5 mm and its width is 2.8 mm. So this kind of LED chip do not have bridge rectifier. So this one needs to be installed in one direction only because one of its polar well, terminal is only good for positive and the other is negative terminal. So next is 3014 LED chip. So this have a bridge rectifier so it can be installed in any direction. So this is 4014 LED chip, so this one have bridge rectifiers that can be installed in any direction and also have uh, heat sinks for better heat dissipation. So this is a 3030 LED chip, so as you observe the chip has its convex lens, so it's similar to Cree LED chip and also has its uh, bridge rectifier and heat sink for better heat dissipation. So this is XHP35 LED chip. So this is uh, one of the powerful LED chip in the market now. So this is CXP1860, so there are two chips on this LED. So this kind of chip is all, are also commonly used on headlight LED. This is also CSP1860, but what's unique on this kind of LED, it's because it has a convex lens on top of the LED chip. So in this portion, we are testing all the LED chips on its power output in terms of wattage. But for 2835 chip, I used uh, my multimeter to check its wattage since my wattmeter has its limit. So in this table, as you observe, the 4014 LED chip has the highest wattage among all them all LED. On this portion, I took the LED light temperature by putting the uh, uh, temperature probe on the surface of the dome light cover lens. So this 
this is 8 watts halogen bulb so there's the probe so after 10 minutes temperature is 61 so, so this is the summary by taking all the te light temperature on each LED So on this lux testing, I insert first the LED on the dome light housing, then measure the lux from its center, 1 meter below, 50 centimeters to the right, left, and up, and down. So doing the same procedure for the rest of the LED, so this is the result or summary. So here we are overall summary. So this is the complete table. And these are all the data gathered after doing testing on all the LED from its lux testing, its power in terms of watts and temperature. If you want to ask my recommendation, I recommend this kind of LED, the 1860 convex lens. This is offered by Max GTRS. So this is only 1.5 watts, but this is the most, this is the brightest among the LED that I, that I tested. In terms of price, this is. Uh, the most expensive among the LEDs that I tested. So thank you for watching and see you again on my next video. Bye bye.